I wanted to go over here. Nope. We want to go the other way. Ah, I know. Yeah, I think the worms are more for a meme than actual functionality. Also, I think fire is like one of the most common element types in this game. Uh, you know what? Actually, we should fight these guys. Just roll a shadow storm. Give him that mischance. That's it. Anybody weak to no fire? Let's get him with an another shadow storm. Maybe a dark shroud. Seeing as we've got splatter, there's no reason not to just wail on that one guy. Yeah, that hurts a bit. Do life wave. Could do occult power. Could do spore. Could do give me your buffs. Hey, which actually works as a heal for her. I forgot about that. Okay, Shadow Storm. I really should probably have, should probably invest points into buffing that up. Who's got? I don't know. You got, you got buffs. You got too many buffs. Give me, give me those buffs. Oh, we're blind, aren't we? Well, when in doubt, add some bleed. This team is just too good. Tons of debuffs. Fairly durable. And bleed that goes for literal days. There we go. Our nation. Okay, can't get over there. I think we need the griffin for that one. Maybe we don't. But it feels like we do. Nope, that wasn't anything fancy. All right. Hello. Time for dialogue again. The mysterious reveal of the evil villain that we saw, like, ten episodes ago. <laughs> I think the main thing with bleed parties is very few enemies have good counters to them. And while the fish party has some debuffs... This bleed combo has way more debuffs. I wish I could fit a little bit more on, but it's okay. Hello, goons. All right, so how do we want to do this? Start with dragon skin? Nah. I'm just going to take that regen. Okay. So this very clearly is a debuff party. Luckily, that's not a big... Okay, that... That ain't enough. Okay, pop that. Probably Poison Cloud the key in. Wow, that does some harm to it. So far, so good. Just ouch on the debuffs. I have absolutely met my match here. Okay, Toxic Slam. Give me that. Let's see, he's weak to Ice Bolt. There we go. Oof. Do we pop a Life Wave? Yeah, these guys are deleting themselves just by existing. 
But I'm just going to keep clearing debuffs for a bit. Uh, let's see, I've got a Dark Shroud. If I want to... Yeah, let's hit the Cat Zerker. There we go. Yeah, overall, pretty happy with this team. Obviously has a lot of... A lot of issue living and clearing all the debuffs, but that's not as big of a problem as I thought it was going to be. Give them buffs. Have some bleed instead. And yeah, because because we got splatter, it just transfers to the next unfortunate victim. It's pretty good. Hit him with spore. Man, that actually does a decent decent chunk to him. Uh what are you weak to? Lightning. Honestly, probably just hit him with a nice bolt. 24 bleed. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Okay, let's, let's get rid of all of, all of those. Just don't want it. Uh, let's see. Unfortunately, unfortunately, Toxicus is not exactly the kind of person you want to poison. It was fine. Goodbye. Hey. What? How could this happen, Ostanius? I had the perfect strategy. Hey, it's not my fault. I did my part perfectly. Hey, looks like we missed the action. Did you defeat both of them, Smushkatsa? We did, but that's not important right now. We've been deceived. Over 20 years ago, Marduk took on the appearance and identity of Eric, and he used us to open the abandoned tower. The alchemists weren't waiting at the, in the tower, they just followed us inside. Unbelievable. Marduk used our trust against us. Bad news. I'm still trying to process how it happened, but I also lost against Chimes. It means he's got my familiar now, too. That makes three. That ruthless villain of a brother. I'm sorry for your loss, Julia. I know exactly how it feels. No matter. We need a new plan. Will, you and I should put these two alchemists away again. Once we've done that, we'll come back here as fast as possible. Sounds good. Let's go. And I'll scout ahead again. It's not like I have much else to lose now anyway. Don't worry. I know we'll all get our spectral familiars back. The alchemists don't have anywhere to run now. She's right, and all we can do now is to keep uh, is to keep following this path to the top of the tower. I doubt we'll have to face chi or no doubt we'll have to face chime along the uh, chimes along the way as well. Don't worry about me. I know you're a remarkable monster keeper. Our journey together showed me that. If there's anyone who can defeat him, it's you. Ferg the Savior, who I have literally not used in like <laughs> way too long. Ah, uh, I feel bad. Like here, here's my monster. All right, he's gone. <laughs> uh, we could try like a poison, a super poison eater. Oh. Okay. Do we have any teams that are not? Okay. Nope. So we want to do a Super Poison Eater team. Okay, equipment, unequip all from all monsters. Okay. Team. Ferg. No, probably Ferg like there. Fun guy. And Trogdor. Okay, so Fun Guy has two dominances, multi poison, and poison veins. Plus poison stuff. Trogdor. Eh, maybe Trogdor still would be better than the uh than the pig. 
Anyway, Trogdor's got Multi-Poison and Poison Eater. And Ferg has a lot of healing and Poison Eater and Multi-Poison. Uh, let's see, inventory. Er, that's not what I want. Uh, let's get rid of that. We've got two level 40 badges, which I'm going to just squander on Ferg and Trogdor. Okay, we want a skill resetter. That's it. Because I don't think I built Ferg very well. I like that force of nature. So, 600 plus 100% of magic, or two times... No, definitely channeled heal. Okay, so we got multi-channel, channel, healing, healing shield, tackle. Do I bother with tackle? Nah. Do I bother with taunt? No. Buffing heal, extra channel, poison eater, double poison eater. Mana stability and toxin and power healing. Okay, grab those. Go for healing wave. Grab warlock healing, toxic feedback, poison glands. Okay, so far so good. And he wants mana. Unfortunately, there's he doesn't have a whole lot of stat bits for me to snag. But that's okay, there we go. And do we want to go for a healing wave or heal? Probably heal. Okay, Trogdor. Probably Corrosive Assault. And he's got one more point. I'm not really using him as much of a healer here. He's got the max level Poison Eater. Okay, and then Fungi is pretty good. The only thing I would have maybe wanted on Fungi is Saboteur. Fungi is Saboteur's shield. Okay. So this, he just wants magic. I know he's got beating, but it's not really that good. He's still an all-rounder, but we mostly want magic. Honestly, give him hammer? Or we just go moon sword. Let's give him the hammer. Because he exists mostly to let the other guys wail on things. Uh, let's grab a hide. And slime skin? Slime skin. Makes him nice and tanky. Okay. So, f go for the crit. Maybe, no, give him the moon sword. He benefits most from that. Uh, let's see. Omni ring? Right. Because Ferg, I forgot about this. Ferg benefits from mana.
Yeah, reduces damage taken and increases damage dealt by 1% for every 20 current mana. Which is actually really good. Okay, so we're just going for pure raw mana. Shield generator? Works. Mana and mana regen? Works. Okay, Trogdor. Honestly, give him the Trident. Oh, either the Trident or the Heavy Mace. I like the Trident. I think it works better for him. Okay. Trogdor. Give him the Poison Dart. Oh no, he's not crit. So we got another hide. Do we give him the dumbbell? Yeah. Okay. I have no idea if this team's any good. I'll come up with a better name for this at some point, but I'm just going to call it Poison Team. We'll probably mix it with like a full-on burn team. You defeated those two alchemists two-on-one, didn't you? Wow. I can still remember seeing you stroll into the Keeper's Stronghold with your very first monsters in tow. <laughs> huh? You look confused, perhaps because I seem so upbeat despite what happened to my familiar? To be honest, more than anything, I'm disturbed by that Chimes guy himself. Behind his mask, I can sense a sad, pitiful person. I can understand how he feels wanting to be a Spectral Keeper himself, but his victory is nothing but a sham, and he knows it too. Don't let your guard down, though. Neither against him or that other alchemist, Zosimos. I'll let you take the lead at this point. Use all that you've learned as a monster keeper to beat them. And if you lose, I'll swoop in and save the day. Uh, let's see, what do we want to do th with the other team? Now that I think about it, I I should probably focus on pushing towards the end. But if I get if I get ganked by a keeper battle, I'm going to want two full teams. What the hell's the penguin? Pangan? There's, there's Pangan. Please tell me bird mage. It is a bird. Team bird. Where's the weird horse dodo? Uh, if I can find it. There it is. Oh, we got another question mark egg, which I'm pretty sure it's just, yeah, it's another plague rib. Okay. That is a good point. We can always just bail. Doesn't the frog have non-crits do more damage? Uh, does he? I don't think the Ferg has that. You're probably thinking Trogdor. Trogdor has that. Ferg does not. Okay. Aerial and Reptile. Oh. Aerial. Oh, Kangamato sucks. All right. Apparently, Aerial is different from Bird, which I guess makes sense, but is a damn shame. Well, Brib, I guess. Because I know Brib gets the Bird bonus. Honestly, though, I might just leave this team for later. Maybe we just go for the multi-freeze. Oh. Maybe that's what I want to go for.
multi-chill monster sanctuary. Who's got it? Shaw Copper. Mogwai. An Ice Blob? I know Wisp also has it. But I don't think I care that much. A wisp is very much kind of in the okay territory. The hell? There's Mogwai, right. Uh, let's see, where's the... Where's the ice blob? Oh, it's blob. There we go. Unfortunately hard to exactly see. So he has congeal, which is a bonus. Man. I built this guy around one way. And I'm not sure if I'd continue to build in the same. We can get him one more level. So let's get Copy Shield and Shield Aura. I don't think he needs Icy Skin. So he's got Congeal. I think this guy also might have Congeal. No, he doesn't. Or not Congeal. Yeah, it is Congeal. Is Mogwai the one I'd want to go with, though? I don't know. I guess Spectral Wolf would have been also a decent one. Or the Araklich. What is his setup? Remove debuffs. I don't know. I'll think about this team later. I've spent way too much time just looking at stuff today. And while I find it incredibly compelling just figuring out who I can micromanage, I also would like to beat the game. In a reasonable hour. Uh, let's see, who has Ignite? You do. Look, a torch puzzle. Whoops. Nope. There we go. Is that everything? Yes. We get some steel and some silk. Not the most exciting things ever, but it's fine. Let's see, is, the way, is there a way for you to get the other spectral guardians? Presumably, I know how to cheat them in, but I haven't done that yet, because that sounds boring. Why there's a shortcut for that. Oh well. Okay. Bleed team. Or not bleed team. Poison team. Do your thang. Let's wreck the Keelan. Holy moly. Alright. Bye. Okay. That, uh... That's got some merits. Uh, let's see. What does this bug me to? Ah. Let's hit him with Bubble Burst. Uh, let's see. Hit him with the Corrosive Jabs. This is Corrosive Assault, but we apparently are out of mana on this guy. Something to consider. Uh, 
Okay. More bubbles. If only you could transfer poison. I... Yeah? Alright. So this team had... A little bit more efficacy than I was expecting. We might want to consider that one. Like, we might want to actually have them stick around. I knew you would get here eventually. I was looking forward to meeting you again. Your determination and skill could have made you an alchemist without equal. A shame that we are on opposite sides. A shame indeed. You would have made a formidable monster keeper yourself. Perhaps. But no matter the aptitude or the effort, a life lived without real purpose is worthless. All the sanctuary can ever offer is an empty purpose, as all the people of the sanctuary live only to perpetuate the sanctuary itself. The same could be said of the alchemists of your order, serving only to per perpetuate the order's existence. Well, that is where you were wrong. If we only wanted to per perpetuate our order, all we'd have to do is kneel and accept to be prisoners of the sanctuary. What we seek is more than that, a return to the way the world was as well as a refusal to be pushed aside with no right to decide our f oh, uh, no, sorry, with no right to decide over our fates. You were never forced to stay in the sanctuary. You could leave, set out into the old world, and do whatever you like. I did travel the old world for a time. The life that it offered me was perhaps even more shallow than the life I lived as a monster keeper. There's nothing we can say to make you change your mind, is there? No, there's not. Ready yourselves, Spectral Keeper. We need your Spectral Familiar. Okay, so, unfortunate. well, let's just see how this team goes, because the other team is just not ready. But that's fine. BAM! Uh, let's see, honestly, let's just hit him with a Bubble Burst instead of going for a Poison Eater. Bye. I... This team is wild. Just five poison right there. Okay, I'm gonna give him a full offense. Because I'm gonna have him do Corrosive Assault. Oh, they're all resistant to it. Well, son of a butt, whatever. Have debuffs, you schlubs. This is that they don't do anything to me. <laughs> All right. There we go. Poison eater. Who needs a good munching? Let's get rid of the grummy. Their poison team too. Technically, it's like an aquatic team, but yeah. <laughs> it's just kind of sad watching just his attacks bounce off of me. Okay, head for the Grulu, I think, because I think the Grulu needs to die. That's probably good enough. Wow. I I honestly did not expect this team to be nearly as righteous as it is. But uh they don't take prisoners. Like I don't think I've really seen them take damage this entire time. <laughs> I guess that doesn't really work. And I think we're blind. Oh, whatever, kill this guy. Lead is still in more impactful in terms of damage. Sort of, 
it's the Poison Eater that's great. The other thing is this group just has insane sustain. Because, like, none of them are taking damage. And, like, the survivability here is way high. Okay. Oh. I guess I should probably just do corrosive jabs. Trogdor really has mana issues. Yep, I'll work on that one. You've proven your fighting spirit once again. I cannot fathom where you get the energy f to from uh, energy from to defend the sanctuary so passionately. As much as you would believe the alchemist deserve, uh, as much as you believe in the alchemist deserving a place in the old world, our belief in the sa monster sanctuary is greater. These two voices start converging after a certain point. It's a serious problem. I can see that. I can see that. How pitiful. Never mind. Evidently, I can't stop you from proceeding, so you may pass. Okay. So, this team is too good. We gotta get, uh, Frosty the Snow Party to actually be a thing. Uh, let's see. Who would I switch in? Honestly... Yeah, are there any specific monsters or or abilities that really make use of chill damage? Like, there's Congeal, which is an obvious one. We could also actually just go for... Mad-Eye and Boo. There's also Draco Zool. But he's very much like a. He, he's very much a dragon party. What about Owie? Because Owie has Congeal and Fatal Upkeep. There is an ability that does 100% true damage when taking chill damage, I think. Can you look that one up? Because I haven't... If it exists, I haven't seen it yet. I think you're limited to a specific monster type if you're going for chill. It's true. What I'm looking for is people that have unique abilities that make chill extra deadly. Oh, Flash Freeze. Trigger an additional 100% damage hit when applying a chill debuff with an attack. That's probably what you're talking about. That's okay. Does have deep freeze, but no multi chill. Who has deep freeze? Deep freeze monster sanctuary. Okay, Frosty learns it, Ice Blob learns it. Shock. Okay, there's our team. Do I have a... I do not have a level 40. Well, um... You know, I've got a billion of these. Yeah, so the Penguin, the Ice Blob, and the Wisp all have it. I don't actually think this is going to be a very good team. Because as well as Dragon ba Mastery might help. None of these are dragons, though. That's the thing. Flash Freeze, Cooling, Multi-Chill. Oh. Balls.
That's fine. Stay away from... So I want to get magic proc and barrier. Grab buffing shield and those. So what I really want is the other one. What kind of bizarro talent tree is this? Okay. I want to keep going safe cast or full offense. Probably just kind of whatever. I mainly wanted to get him Ice Shield. Maybe going down this line isn't helpful. I was hoping for buffing Restore, but I, I think we're spreading him too thin. I bet I also haven't shifted him. What's he got? Extra Stack or Dark Instinct? I'm not really using him as much of a buffer. Okay. Skills. So let's ignore that that one tree. Okay. Honestly, I might even just give him Ice Storm. Because I mostly wanted to get down to Mana Shielding and Defense proc. And Flash Freeze. Put one into this just so we can get buffing shields. No, shelter, mainly. Okay, extra defense. Now let's take a look at what I'm going to do with him, because I think this is a little bit better. Hey, thank you, Cryerus, for the raid. Oh, come on in. I am kind of trying to go, go towards the end, but I keep getting distracted with new combos that I want to play with. Let's see. Let's see. Do we go for... The next level of Chilling Wind and Barricade, or just go for Mana Proc? Let's go for Barricade. Okay, Pengen. Pengen's got a couple of things. Hits all enemies, chance to apply Chill, chance to apply Shock, remove... Let's go for the Mega Restore. Blizzard, how's Blop looking? I think... Blop, I got a little bit too distracted as well. Going down his list. I think I'll just leave it as is for the time being. Uh, let's see. We're investing on him. Probably Saboteur's Shield. Okay, so... Magic. Magic... Magic defense and magic defense again. Okay, so Penguin. So we only have two wands. Whoops. Do you have any more orbs? I do. Wizard hat, scroll. Let's see, how's the mana? It's okay. Probably get him Lightning Sphere just because. Wisp is. Wants the wand for the magic defense.
Defense mana regen. Chance to apply burn? Eh, it's not a terrible idea on him. Another wizard hat. Another scroll? Cool. Okay. Pretty much same deal here. So this is going to be a very heavy shield, not a lot of heal team. Which can have some downsides. Not a lot of mana regen on this dude. Uh, I guess I'll just go tome. Okay. Oh, you know the other thing? Food. I don't know what to give him. Mana? What do I give to Penguin? I mean, honestly, if I had more of those cookies... I've got a couple cookie mushrooms. Let's just do that. Alright, so now we've got Freeze Team. Wait. Have I fed the other guys? Nope. Okay. Fun Guide needs... Banabra. 